Most of us make financial goals in January, but have you stopped to check up on those? Consumer investigator Rachel DePompa found out from a financial educator that it's probably time for a summertime reset. She explains more in this Watching Your Wallet. In the beginning of a year, we all make these big, audacious financial goals. We're all excited about becoming financially responsible. But oftentimes, as the year progresses, life happens. Obstacles come up. Unexpected purchases arrive. Kiani Epps is a financial educator from the popular website and YouTube channel, The Responsible Home Girl. She says it's so important to have a summertime reset. So this is my way of telling everyone it's not too late to get back in the game. Revisit those financial goals that you set at the beginning of January. Get locked back in on those financial goals. Start back managing your money. It's just my message um, to tell people don't get discouraged. Start back, pick it back up anytime. Epps says look back at your January goals. Reflect what have you been doing that's not in alignment with those goals? Where do you want to go from here? Is that eating out too much? Do I need to pull back on that area? Have I not been budgeting consistently? Do I need to start budgeting? So really look at your behavior and what you have been doing from January until now that you're not so proud of and then start making small changes. Sometimes we get so hyped up about the big things, but I tell people all the time, don't despise the small beginnings. She says it's not a time to get discouraged. It's a time to think you can do this. Use the information you gather about your finances to add fuel to the fire. Epp says if you don't have vision for your money, you'll just do whatever you want with it, which probably doesn't align with the goals you set for yourself. It will go to so many other places instead of your savings account or retirement account, maybe even your vacation fund. With this Watching Your Wallet, I'm Rachel DePampa.